already what we've seen with um, the indoor season is 120 new teams. The Calgary Minor Soccer Association is seeing an increase in momentum in the sport and is kicking off another season with record numbers. But with growth comes challenges. Last season, CMSA had a record-breaking 30,000 participants. This season, 6,400 games need to be scheduled, which CMSA says is becoming increasingly more complicated by the limited availability of indoor soccer facilities. With this growth, uh, the challenge becomes, you know, how are we going to accommodate everybody and how are we going to make, make sure that we stay, you know, long-term player development uh, compliant and how do we make sure that we can evolve our game formats as we move into the future here. And Clubs are having a really hard time to find a, a good place to practice. The practice was mostly at uh, schools and the school gyms are very small. Can you tell me about practicing soccer in a basketball gym? Oh, it sucks. There's like, there's not a lot of air conditioning, so you get really hot and sweaty. And it's really easy to get floor burns, like you can't really do anything. It just takes away your confidence because you don't feel like you can do anything. And it's really small and enclosed. With growing interest in youth soccer, Bruno says one of the biggest challenges is infrastructure. And practicing in a gym isn't that uncommon. You want to be training in the place that you're competing. And, and right now, that is, uh, there's no capacity for that. And, Many of our clubs will be using gymnasiums and um, other uh, places to train uh, when they should really be in where they're playing. CMSA has already extended the season to accommodate interest, but they're at risk of turning down young athletes, which can also put pressure on parents. I mean, we're at the, the tipping point right now where we're, we're seriously contemplating uh, capping our programs and and um, unfortunately having to turn people away. You gotta be on the ball when it comes to the registration time. So it's like a full-time job just kind of going over when the registration opens and when it closes. Because if you miss that mark, it's hard to get kids into sports. CMSA says they are advocating for the development of new facilities in collaboration with the city, but more funding and support is needed. In Calgary, Rain Rashid, City News.